Just a minute. Jesus, dude, when was the last time you showered? Fuck off. Am I, uh, interrupting your breakfast? I can have cereal at whatever time of day I want, all right? Yeah, yeah, I guess so. Did you, um, did you forget about Jen's birthday? I haven't been, uh, super focused lately. Did you, uh, get her anything? No. That's okay. We'll, we'll stop somewhere on the way over. Can I finish my cereal first? Yeah, just hurry up. Maybe shower, too. I think she liked your gift. What? I think Jen liked the candles you got her. Wow. Oh. Yeah, that's good. Uh, listen, man, if you ever want to talk about you know who, I'm, I'm here. Or just stop. What? Just stop trying to tell me you know what it's like. Okay, well, I mean, I'm, I'm just saying, I've been in relationships before, and they've ended. I don't think sleeping with a girl for a week and then having her ghost you is like being in a relationship. It was more than a week, but... I know you're trying to help, but I'm fine. Ryan's party is next week, so just don't forget about that. Okay. Just text me next week to remind me. No, I will. Okay. I will. Uh, Leo. Uh, look, I'm sorry if I was, like, stepping on your toes before or anything. I'm not, I'm not trying to get into your business. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm a shitty friend. You're not a shitty friend. Okay. You... You were there for me when Rachel dumped my ass last year, so. She was awful. Whatever. That worked out for the best. Whatever. All right. All right, dude. See ya. See ya. Look, I love you. I didn't mean to say what I said. I was high and I wasn't thinking right. I'm so sorry. You're getting closer. Have you talked to Dr. Brew about it? No, and I don't know. Therapy is kind of repetitive and it doesn't really help anything, so. I really think you should start meeting with her again. This doesn't sound good, Leo. It's not that bad, Lise. Well, last week you told me you almost got hit by a car, and last night you were texting me that you don't remember leaving your house. Those messages you sent me were really freaking me out. I did not get hit by a car, it was stopped at a stop sign. I'm not playing games here, Leo. You're gonna get yourself killed. You're, you're living in your head. And are you smoking weed again? That could be why you aren't remembering things. I'm gonna call mom first.
know what's been going on with you. Are you even listening to me? Yeah. Yes. Don't, um, don't call mom. I'll call mom. I'm sorry. I'm not trying to worry you. Just get it figured out. It's scaring the shit out of me. Yes. Yeah, I will. I love you. Okay. Bye. Bye. I want to move to San Francisco with you. We could start fresh, you know? Get away from all this shit. I would do that. In a couple years when we have money and we're out of school. I want to do it right when we graduate. I think we should move there together. <laughs> My parents would not like that. <laughs> Who cares what your parents would think? It's whatever you want to do, Leo. You'll be out of school and on your own. It's whatever you want. And I think we should move together. What about Mac? And like Ryan and Connor? <laughs> Don't get over it. There's nothing here for me anymore, Leo. I need to get out of this city. I do too, just not right now. Can we talk about this later? Yeah, let's talk about it later. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to upset it's you. It's fine. Let's just talk about it later. Why didn't you move to San Francisco? I don't know. I guess I was scared. What did you mean when you said I was getting closer? You're getting closer to the end. What the hell is that supposed to mean? You know exactly what it means. The dream version of me seems sad. Sad how? He said he's trapped reliving these memories with her. He's haunted by the choices we've made. Oh. I mean, yeah, that'll do it. I don't know what to do, Mac. The dreams are getting more interactive. It's like I'm having full conversations with myself. Maybe these dreams are trying to help you? What do you mean? Like, maybe these dreams are helping you relive these experiences so you can get over them. Like a form of therapy or, or something. But your brain is doing it subconsciously. I guess that makes sense. He said we were getting closer to the end. I think I know what that means, but I feel like it is building to something. I just don't know if I'm ready for it. Well... You know how it ends, right? What are you afraid of? Hey, can we talk about San Francisco again? Do we have to right now? I already told you, I need more time. Time for what? Are you ever going to be ready to move away with me? <laughs> We've been talking about this since the day we met, and now here we are, four years later, in the same place we were. There's nothing here for me anymore, Leo. I want to. I really do. <laughs> Just not right now. This is ridiculous. I don't even know why I try with you anymore. What is that supposed to mean? You never listen. 
First you say, we're gonna move away someday, and then you say you're gonna work on yourself, and so far, you haven't done either. Maybe I'm not the problem. I mean, you're the one trying to change me all of a sudden. I I'm not trying to change you. I'm trying to build a life with you. We both know that this is not a recent issue. We've been growing apart for months. I want a life full of adventure and experiences. I can't find that here. Why am I not enough for you? It's not that. I love you, Leo. I just need something more. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna go home and think about some stuff. Okay. Don't. Why did you let me leave? You should have saved me! Jesus, dude, when was the last time you showered? Uh, did you forget about Jen's birthday today? It's okay, if, if you did, uh, we can always stop somewhere on the way over and grab something. Leo, are you okay? 